Um, it's called Fulfillment Web Service. So another area where Amazon, I think, is, is unique in this world <coughs> is fulfillment. Now, in essence, um, I don't know how many square foot we have, 20, 20 million? Is that? 12 million. 12 million, 12 million square foot uh, fulfillment. Uh, what we've done recently, or recently, last year, we, we, uh, we started a program called Fulfillment by Amazon, where basically any customer of Amazon, that is, for example, a merchant that sells on the Amazon platform, can send his inventory to Amazon and we'll ship it for you. Yeah, so, until now, this is a sort of an in, in, interactive product. You ship it, you know, your labels are being printed, you put it on your boxes, and uh, through some web interface you indicate that you sold some things, or maybe through the Amazon Merchant program it's automatically sold. Um, what we've done now with the new service is actually give you a programmatic interface <coughs> to uh, fulfillment by Amazon. So you've shipped some of your goods to Amazon warehouses, we'll place them strategically, uh, such that we can give delivery guarantees to your customers. We'll also take care of the retailers and things like that. Now, imagine you go build your application in EC2. Uh, now we have mechanisms for customers that visit your software as a service in EC2 and that need to have something shipped. We can use the fulfillment web service to automatically have these goods being dispatched um, to, to your customers. So this falls into the category where well, not only we do fulfillment, but in another area where Amazon is really good at, I think over time, and showing, um, showing our trustworthy of, of our customers is uh, payments. So now you see a whole set of services slowly developing where people can use our infrastructure services to build basic uh, uh, applications and, and take specific e-commerce uh, services to, to build big online uh, applications.